Hey, it's Arit here from Estatino Media, where we show you how to create profitable content. And on this video, I'm going to show you how to perfectly align your fillable fields on Adobe Acrobat Pro DC. It would take me so long to try to perfectly align these fields on the form and I would get so frustrated. But luckily, Adobe has a feature where you can align the fields perfectly and it's just using one click so you don't have to spend so long trying to adjust the fields. So let me show you what this looks like. So as you can see here, I have already some fields on this form that I designed and I'm going to have to create some fields checkboxes here as well as for these ones. So I'm going to click on text field because that's what I need and it's going to be in your best interest to try to get it lined up as much as possible but of course it's not perfect so I'm just gonna click and drag these pieces here and you can see it's not fitting perfectly in the box but that's whoops we'll close this but that's the whole thing right we want to get these lined up so instead of trying to really do these little micro adjustments to have everything lined up I'm gonna click and drag to select all of these fields and I'm going to come over here to the corner where it says align center. When I click on that, it's going to align everything center. You see it shifted this box over. And then what I also want to do is match the size of the, the height of these fields to make sure they're all the same size. So I'm going to click on this one right here, match height. See here, it fits nicely. nicely. And the last thing I'm going to do is click on distribute vertically which means that it's going to equal the spaces between each of the fields so that it's all you know perfectly aligned so i'm going to click on that and that moved that down a little bit and that's it i don't have to touch this you can see here when i go to close this out these fields now look perfectly aligned whereas before it was all wonky and all over the place so you could do this as well with check boxes you can Come over here, create these checkboxes or any type of field really. So I'm just going to click and click there and then come back to the pointer and adjust it like this. And I'll show you the other types of adjustments as well. So off to the side here, you can align things by making sure it's aligning in the center. So let's say this checkbox is, you know, one checkbox is above and one checkbox is below. So we want to click and drag this and I'm going to hit on align horizontal center and it's going to shift, make any sort of adjustments that need to be made. And then I'm also going to click on match size so that they're the same size of checkboxes. Maybe the next thing I want to do now is to make sure that these boxes all align and are the same size. So again, I'm going to take my cursor here, click and drag the boxes to select all of them. And then I want them all to align vertically. So I'm going to come here, click align vertical center. And also these are different sizes. So I'm going to click on match size and we'll click on match height to see what it does. Okay, so I made this one shorter, but we also need to click on match width so that it matches that again. And again, align center. And there you go. That looks nicely aligned versus something like this. Uh, and I just noticed these fields here, they aren't the same width. You can see there's some space here. So again, click and drag. We're going to go to match width. It's going to make them all a little bit wider. And then again, I'll come to align center and probably need to do this again. Distribute vertically. And now they're all the same size, exact same width. And then when we click out of it here, we can see it's all equal like so. So that's just a quick tip on how to get everything aligned. You can play with these different options off to the side here. Like I use align vertically and distribute horizontally, the match sizes, but you can come and play with all of this to see what suits your form best. If you need some help with your form, whether it's designing it or making it fillable, I'm happy to help. I'm going to leave my email address down in the description below. Thank you so much for watching and I will see you in the next video. Bye.